Now, the economic advisor and spokesperson to the vice president, Dr. Gideon Boako, says the NPP is second to none in the economic and development drive of the country. He said, unlike the NDC, the non ecofado led government has many interventions to show for their stewardship. Speaking to Joe News after the launch of the MPP Drivers Association at Jaya Unkwanta, Dr. Gideon Boakon said all hands must be on deck to ensure a resounding victory for the MPP in the December general elections. There's more in this report from Precious Semevo. As the political campaigns heat up with less than two months to the general elections, many political groups continue to spring up. The latest is the NPP Drivers Association at Dwayan Kwanta in the Hafu region. George Kwafu Ousu is the chairman. They give us a promise that when they come to power, they are going to give us free SHS. They are going to make sure that our rejected graduates who are in the house are going to get work to do. But looking at what they've done, it's true that they have performed what they promised. That is why I organize my police drivers. That have you seen what the government is doing? What we can do is to organize ourselves as one union, then campaign for the president so as to continue his good works. The economic advisor and spokesperson to the vice president, Dr. Gideon Boaku, urged the drivers not to relent on their efforts, adding the crucial nature of the impending elections require all hands to be on deck. Looking at what they have done, we are encouraging them, giving them moral support, giving them logistical support, where we need to contribute to make them highly forward to move, we will do so. We are in the process or in a time that every single hand must be put on the deck to make sure that we get a resounding victory in 2020. And whoever is within the arena to help us achieve that victory, we are ready to help them. And the drivers are part of it. At the launch of the association, speaker after speaker touted the achievements of the Nana Kufuadu government, including free SHS. Dr. Bwakun called on Ghanaians to give the NPP another term to continue their unmatched achievements. After eight years of the NDC, if we ask the child on the street to mention anything that Mahama can be remembered with, it will be difficult for them to mention anything. Now, if we fast forward to President Kufuadu's era, at least Ghanaians can talk of free senior high school, we are building industries under the one district, one factory, planting for food and jobs, and all of those fantastic acronyms of development projects. On top of it is the digitization. So it is quite clear that in terms of governance, in terms of development for the people, in terms of economic management, the NPP stands tall and is second to none. And that is why I believe that Ghanaians must continue to keep the NPP and President Kufuadu in power to continue to do more for the people. And that is why we christen it simply as for more to do more for you. Dr. Gideon Bwaku donated a Toyota pickup and 10 motorbikes to the Tano North constituency in the Hafu region to ensure effective day-to-day -day operations of the party's activities. This is where I take ownership as, and I take pride in as a member of the New Patriotic Party. And therefore, I felt I owe it a duty to contribute my widow's might to make sure that the NPP maintains its stake in the Tano North constituency. We needed to support the constituency to empower them and to make them well fortified for the battle ahead. For Joy News, Precious Semevo, Dwayne Quanta.